CEOs, what's up? It's your boy CEO Avshan. I'm back with another video and it's that time of the week, so let's get into it. What I'm thankful for. Choosing to breathe, let alone being able to breathe. Meaning when I look at the things I've gone through thus far, it amazes me how overwhelming things can get. And instead of letting myself suffocate, I'm thankful that I choose to press on forward. Breathing in and out whenever things are hectic is such a calming remedy. I'm grateful that I choose to breathe instead of letting my daily battles put a hope in my objectives for the day. Honestly, the fact that I can breathe is like a sign, proving to me that I'm living, not dying. Being stressed, anxious, let alone dealing with trauma can feel so suffocating at times. I'm grateful through it all. Breathing makes things easier. Reality is what you do next. And before I get into my screenshots, I'd like to just add on and just say this. Um, like, I feel like we're not really like paying attention to our breathing like at every single second of the day, like every minute. So like, for me, it's kind of like humbling, like a, it's like a, it's like a wake up call low and it's subtle though. Like, you feel me? Like in our heads, in our, in our mind, like whatever we're feeling inside our symptoms, right? Um, sometimes it feels like we're literally dying or we're like, we're suffocating, like something is not going right. But then when you really like open your eyes, like open your eyes and realize, yo, I'm breathing, I'm actually alive, like I'm not dying, I'm good. Then it's like a wake up call. It's like, okay, whatever I'm dealing with, whatever I'm feeling, it's just inside, it's just in my head. And re in reality, I'm good for it. Like, just take a moment and breathe in and breathe out. And for me, it's it's made me realize like anytime I feel just anxious or like, you know, things are just a bit overwhelming at the moment, I just breathe in and breathe out and I do it a few, a few times and I just give myself a second to just recoup, regather my thoughts, just readjust in a sense. So for me, it's kind of like, it's dope because it's like when you really think about it, breathing is essential to the way of life. Like without it, we can't live. So whatever we're feeling, whatever we're dealing with at the end of the day, we can always remind ourselves like, yo, breathing, like, yo, breathe. And if you can breathe, you're okay. You're good. Just, just give yourself a moment. You feel me? So with that being said, um, yeah, I'm really thankful for that. And I have two screenshots that I feel like go best with what I had to share with you. Yeah, you. All right. So the first one says, you shouldn't expect yourself to bounce back from difficult times overnight. All difficult experiences will change many things about your life and alter who you become because of them. So be patient and persevere on your road to recovery and well-being. You will get there. I'm going to say that one more time. You shouldn't expect yourself to bounce back from difficult times overnight. All difficult experiences will change many things about your life and alter who you become because of them. So be patient and persevere on your road to recovery and well-being. You will get there. And the last one says, overthinking will really destroy your inner peace. Breathe, relax, let it go. I'm going to say that one more time too. Of course the fan's coming on. Overthinking will really destroy your inner peace. Breathe, relax, let it go. With that being said, yeah, um, you know, any experience that we're going through, whether it's a heartache, like even a headache, it doesn't matter. Like something that came up from the past, remind yourself if you can breathe, you're okay. Just take a moment and just breathe. Breathe in and breathe out. Like a lot of our experiences, things that like, we, we were initially hurt from, it's gonna take some time to like, actually like, you know, get over them, overcome them. But the like the, the number one thing that you should like remind yourself or you can remind yourself is if I'm breathing, I'm living. So it's okay, I'm okay, you feel me? And uh, yeah, if you overthink, if you're always in your head, like again, when you have all these thoughts coming in, like sometimes you forget to breathe. So it's like you're suffocating, but Remind yourself to breathe, let it go, Just be present in your day, recognize where you're at, open your eyes, like literally, you might have your eyes open, but not nah, open your eyes, like, like realize that, you feel me? With that being said, um, of course the fan got on, um, but honestly, that's all I had to really share with you. So now it's your turn to let me know what you had to share with me, let alone what you had to reflect on, um, if you feel like sharing hope so um and yeah with that being said just remember to breathe
don't forget it, okay? It's, it's there in your arsenal to use at any moment, at any given moment of the day. So embrace that, use it to your advantage, especially through those hectic times. And uh, yeah, so whether you reflected right now or like during this video, let alone before or after, that's pretty dope. I'm pretty proud of you. Uh, but yeah, comment down below. Just let me know what you had to reflect on. Or if there's something that you took away from my reflection that either sparked something in your mind, let me know. With that being said, I love you. It's your boy, C. Option. I'm back with another video. Why did I just do that, bro? Ah, uh, bro. I really said I'm back with another video when I'm trying to end this video. No, it's your boy, C. Option. I'm going to catch you tomorrow for this this quote is meant for you because it is meant for you. And uh, with that being said, I love you. I hope you have a blessed day. Peace.